Hi guys, it's Haven here. I am doing a dirty cut flip pour on a 5x7. I had some camera technical difficulties, so we are starting at this point. I was going to show you guys what the inside of my cup looked like, and then flip it over. And I did put a ring of white paint around it, but some paints are sinking out. There's black, there's a silver metallic color, there is um, a pink, a blue, white glitter, a little bit of glow in the dark. There's just kind of this is leftover paint kind of mix in here, and there might even be a touch of purple in here. I'm not sure. But after I do this, and I've got it on the table with the newspaper, of course, and a piece of saran wrap, after I get it poured, I'm going to put it in the box here to dry with the wet, the butcher paper wax side up to save the skin. But after I do this rolling thing here on the canvas, I am going to have some fun with this. I've got you really zoomed in, so i got to remember that. Um, to have some fun with this. It's one of those beaded plastic necklaces, like a Mardi Gras necklace kids have a thing for them. My daughter likes to use them on her little craft projects. We get them at the secondhand store or at the stores when we go in. But this one mommy decided was hers and so I'm going to have some fun with it. And I do have a cup of water here to put it in after I make it all painty mess so I can reuse it. So this has been sitting here for a few moments due to the... I think this is like my fifth take on getting this going. So yeah. So we're going to take this off, and since the is better that way, we are going to bring it out like that. And there is some silicone. Oh, look at that. That looks so cool on the inside. I have to figure out what to do with my cups, because some of them do look really neat. You know what? I might just, I'm going to do it over the box here so I can try to save... Oop, I'm going to torch real quick. Ha ha ha. I'm going to put it down in the box. And I'm going to wipe this off so I don't get some of the paint on it. I want to save the colors for the skin concept. And so I'm going to torch this real fast. Get those bubbles out. Go play with Sissy, please. Okay, I'll try to burn the paper. Okay, so tilt this around for a minute in here. And then we'll do fun. I knew I didn't have enough a lot of paint in there. So this is really gonna have to be stretched out. And a smaller canvas worked perfect for what paint I did have in there. Okay, buddy, please go watch the show with your sister, remember? Why we you set you up on that? The kids have been ever so... I'm going to use the word helpful today. That would be a nice term for it. Hold on. Okay, buddy, please. Your mama. Corners covered. Okay, I'm gonna. That we have that there. Put this back here. Make sure it's still coming out in the middle. I am sorry, I wasn't paying attention to exactly how the filming was going. I usually can try to watch that, but yeah. no. Yeah. No. 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 Nobody. I have what he's wanting to now with. I will show you here in just a sec. Now I showed you in one of my videos that I was putting, doing the little, I don't know what their exact name is, but the little glass parts that you can put in pendants and things. I mean, you can dip in your in <clears throat> the puddle from the paint and stuff. Well, my clothespin idea did not quite work. And I remembered I had some wine corks that I... Yeah? No, let's not take it off, please. That I would saved or er, bought from the secondhand store to do for a craft project. You know, like one of those cork board things. Well, I took the little glass part, some of the poster stuff, 
and put it on top of this because they stand, they stay even pretty good. So the clothespins kept falling over on me. Thankfully they did not mess up. They dried nicely still, but they, it was where I had them drying at. It was not a complete stable spot, so they kept getting knocked over. But yeah, so he is just ah. dying to have mommy. Okay, buddy, go play. Thank you. Go play, go play, go play. Go eat your pop tart. Thank you. Okay, sorry about that. So he is just dying to have help mommy dip them in there and whatnot. Okay, I'm going to torch this real quick. And then we will run that little string for the little bee thing. To see him getting hot because my closet's not really warm. I need to figure out my... It's got some really cool cells looking on here. But, and this is something I've not done. I've done the string poles, but never something that's kind of like doing a, train, a chain pull. Okay, let's see here. There's that one spot. I noticed that I should have cut it closer to... Ah! Ha ha ha! That's one way to get it started, right? I'm trying not to do that. But, I should have cut it closer to the little two bees where they connect it together. And I didn't, so I'm trying to figure out what that is so I don't use it to swipe through. But I'm going to something I've not done, so we're gonna see how this goes. Good thing if things don't turn out, you can always let the canvas dry and reuse it, right? Okay, I'm trying to keep it on top there. Okay, that kind of looks cool. I like that. I'm going to leave it as is and not mess it up. Put my necklace here in the water so it can not let the paint dry all on it. Okay, I like that. I'm going to retorch. That actually kind of came out really spiffy. Hmm. I am glad I decided to try this. I'll bring you in for a close up. We'll check her out. And since I got you up so far on here, I'm gonna bring the camera down to do a close up on it. I think it's really gonna focus very much on here. Okay, so I hope this is it's looking blurry on my end. So I think I'm going to let me well now. I am not a technical person, so we're going to try to make this somewhat of a close-up. But, yeah, it looks kind of cool. It did definitely give it a line through it. And there is silicone in this, so I'm pretty sure most more cells will be coming out. So, yeah. Yeah, I'm not a technical person, so I don't know why it's not letting me zoom out more than what it is. But, there we go. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, leave comments, let me know what you think of it. Um, yeah, thank you for watching, and don't forget to laugh, because a day without laughter is a waste of day. Again, thank you, and have a great day. Until next time, bye.